Hello everyone, I'm Social Democrat Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Kaiserreich, continuing playing as the Republic of China. So, I've just noticed something, that we have 64% party popularity. We're pretty darn popular, and we are getting, every day, a little bit more popular support from the people. Because we have a new culture movement. We barely increase our popularity, but... Over time, everyone will be believing in our government and our party, even if they don't want to. I love it. Cool. Oh, tactical bombers. Nice. So last time, what did we do? We took out a big old chunk of the supposed reformed government of China. We even made sure we had Beijing under complete control and that our power over Beijing will never be contested once again. Now let's double check for upgrades. Nope, 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 nope. Awesome. So, right now we're going to let our guys kind of rest up. We are out of artillery, which isn't good. And we're out of infantry equipment, which isn't good as well. Um, go ahead and upgrade the bombers. Yeah, it's fine. We're not making any of these guys because, oh my goodness, we need a lot of steel. No, I really don't want to trade with Russia, but what about the German Empire? Just one. Uh, no, I really don't want to trade with these guys, but whatever. Go ahead and do that. Uh, oh, wait. What did I get? Oh, I need aluminum, too. Hmm. Well, I'm glad Hungary still exists. Do that. Give me some more rubber. Yes, princely federation. Sure. Because I... Oh, Middle Africa wouldn't be bad. But whatever. Force rotation. Awesome. I'm going to continue... Uh... I like doing that, but I really, really need to focus on a navy. I need at least some sort of navy before uh, I try to navy invade Japan. I don't know how long this campaign is going to go. I'll let you know. I am thinking that this might be a pretty long campaign just because I want to take out pretty much every nation that uh, supported or tried to or began the century of humiliation for China. Now, that does include the British, the Canadians... Union of Britain people, maybe. Maybe not the Commune of France, but maybe the French Republic. I mean, the Germans were, were there, the Austrians were there, the Americans were there, the Russians were there. I mean, everyone around the world just said, screw you, China, and that really hurt us. And we don't want that to happen again. So, <clears throat> we might just show up in their lands and subjugate them to us. So, I don't know. Let's see what happens. Cool. But in the meantime... I will attack where I think I can, hold on, do well-ish. If I had all you, but you, attack there. Could that work? Maybe not. They have four divisions there. Oh, but maybe. Throw, I know you guys are looking, lacking guns and artillery pieces. That's okay. All that, oh. I guess you weren't connected to there. That's okay. Are you connected here? You are. Nice. Get rid of this tile, and then we can encircle four divisions. Good. Not bad. We still need more medium tanks, but we're doing pretty well in medium tanks. Yesterday, we had, like, a deficit of 1,300. So, not bad. You guys hold. Don't move. Awesome. And you're there. Great. Four divisions encircled, and they will be dead soon. <clears throat> no naval invasions for now. Shanghai civilization capital. Once I'm done with the war with Japan, or at least if they've been pacified enough, I will go to war with... Relegation cities, if they do not accept my demands of annexation. Who would just invade? Is that... Who are you fighting? Ah, uh, the Entente. Who is that? That's not Canada, I think. So small, I can't read it. Hmm. Can I move up anywhere here? I mean, yeah. I really shouldn't move or anything. Uh, how much of an air force do these guys have? <clears throat> Excuse me. Not much. We're really lacking quite a few different type of guys here. Or at least different types of planes. Oh my goodness. Fuel wise, we're doing okay. Political power, we're doing pretty darn well. We're still integrating provinces, still industrializing provinces. We're building up more military factories as well as civilian factories. Could be much, much worse. Then again, I need more steel and tungsten and stuff like that. Give me more steel. I really don't want to do this. I really don't want to support Russia. But I have to. 
at least make me yeah, at least a little bit of artillery every day. That's going to be really important. Good, good, good. Nice, 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 nice. So, oh, uh oh, oh no. Oh, oil, Ottoman Empire. Come on, guys. No, oh, Romania, you're next. Then, if I can grab one from you, that'd be great. Research, though. Shock and is almost done. Our land auction is almost done. Synthetic oil experiments. Let's get in there. Construction 5. Well, we just basically started that one. And those ships. Not bad. Not bad. Oh! Hello. Goodbye. Romania. I just asked you for fuel and you say no. No. Not Russia. No. I don't want Russia. Uh, I might have to do Russia. No. Persia. Persia. There you go. Still not enough factories. More aluminum. Yeah. Aluminium, please. Thank you, Hungary. Yeah, I'm going to make a lot of civilian factories just so I can trade them away. That's pretty much it. I just need to trade them away. Oh, they're attacking me. Oh, that's interesting. I thought they might be a little bit too weak to attack me, but you know what? Japan is always full of surprises. <clears throat> What's the air superiority like? Eh, not great. Not great. But at least we can try to do something against them. Nice. I do want to take down take down these guys take these guys down here. But we need more strength. Give our guys a little bit more time. Our deficit of guns guns is doing really well. Two hundred a day? Not bad. Artillery? Pretty good. Continue to industrialize though. I need them. I need those men. And I will do diverge more resources to the navy when I have enough dockyards and have the research for ships, which will take a long time. Um, really anything else? I could integrate more things. Production of stuff is going okay. I'm glad that I'm already on total mobilization. Light tank manufacturer? Eh, that's okay. National Air Army. I could upgrade my tanks to the next level, but at this point, I have other things to research, so I'm not going to. Intervene. You know what? Light aircraft, heavy aircraft, strategic airfields, forts. These are all nice. They're quite nice, but I don't really... They're not, like, screaming to me, I have to have them. War goal against them. Yeah. But, you know what? Let's try Dare to Die Corps. It is a sad fact that in these desperate times, <clears throat> often all a man is able to do is... to A cause is his life. The concept of Dare to Die soldiers as patriotic martyrs dates back to the Xinhai Revolution. But during the Warlord Era, the term expanded to refer to all small arms or small units tasked with suicidal attacks. As the war expands, dare to die tactics and the original Zin high spirit that accompanied it begin to show their appeal. A little bit more war support, more organization, reconnaissance, and effect of our partisans, which, at this point, we don't really need suicidal attacks, but you know what? As long as the people think that they need it, why did Kashmir just turn princely? I don't think I've ever seen that, but perhaps that's part of a focus for the Princely Federation, which probably it looks like it actually is. A new federation? No? What was that? That's kind of cool, actually. Ah, incite Kashmir to rebellion. Oh, that makes sense. That's kind of cool. Pact with the North. <clears throat> Invade the commune. That's actually kind of cool. It's actually really kind of cool. Oh, oh, Japan. Guys, guys, guys. I love what you're doing here, but this doesn't make any sense. But then again, this is the Hoi for AI. Let them kill themselves on our line. We've lost about two-thirds of a million. A little less than that. They've left, definitely lost a lot. What's the capital of, of... Yeah, there they are. There they are. God dang it, guys. Come on. Germany. Germany. I know you're struggling. I know you really are. But you got to stop this, man. You really got to stop this. And I want to build my own refinery so I can make my get my... Produce my own oil and my own fuel. I really, really need that. I'm hungry. Just give me one more thing of these. Because that doesn't hurt us too much, actually. Give me more military factories. 40%. 110%. Yeah. 110%. Beautiful. Um, oops. God dang it. Whatever. And then I will make, in time, a lot of dockyards. Because we'll need it. Oh, Germany's failing. Oh, no. They've invaded. Oh, uh, oh boy. Well, we're going to see one heck of a... Kalter Krieg between the Russians 
and the third international because Canada and the Entente was completely kicked out of the British Isles. Man, you are not suffering any problems at all. Germany, though, you still, look, you still really good. What are you doing, Germany? That's causing you to fail so hard. I mean, yeah, you still got encircled. You still have Orleans and Tours, or Orleans and Tours, but... Guys. Oh, they're invading me again. Uh, what happened over here? I might be able to attack here, perhaps. I doubt it. I mean, it's over a river, which isn't very good to attack, but whatever. Actually, you know what? You all attack. Give me half of you guys. You have an upgrade, Young? Oh, yeah. Do that before you start attacking. We might be able to win here. We might not. Doesn't look like we will, but hey, you never know. You never know. 75, get to 76, that'll make me happy. 76, come on. Yeah, yeah, we might win here. Uh, Germany or whoever. Hungary. Wait. Oh, oh, Ottomans. Ottomans. No, Persia. Wait, you're not at war, are you? I don't think you're at war, are you? How do you not have enough fuel? Well, regardless, we'll still get more fuel from there. From them. From them. Cool. Take you off. There you go. Oh, what the? Wait. Uh, yeah, don't move. God dang it. Hold on. You fellas are a bunch of weirdos. And then take all but you two back down there, too. That'll be good. A relatively smallish pocket. Good. Good. So much air XP. Guns are looking real nice. Artillery isn't doing bad. Tanks? Doing pretty darn well on. And I do have a cup of Chinese coffee here, so it's very tasty. Very delightful. If I could get over there, that would be amazing. And I do want it. Uh, you know what? With Outer Ch Mong Outer Manchuria, that's what it is. Um, I might just take it. I might release a puppet. I could maybe... Hmm. I think I'll just take Manchuria. Regular Manchuria. But for Outer Manchuria, that'll give us a claim to go to war with Russia even more. Because that'll be basically my own Russian puppet. Nice. A small little encirclement. So I don't think I'll annex Outer Manchuria in this campaign like I did in my Qing China campaign. But I think that's what we'll do. But good job, guys. Good job. Can, uh, I doubt we'll be able to win here. Could you guys like go ahead and like take this area? That would be great if you could. Oh, more divisions. Oh no! <gasps> yes, we have tanks. Well, a tank division. Yes. Dai Anlan, you're like the only guy who's specialized in tank stuff. So you're obviously going to get the promotion. Anyone else? Who's, what is that? Oh, clique officer. Um, I don't want to really send him under Lee because he's not a Panzer guy, but there's no one else here who can do anything else, so. You know what? With the formation of the new Chinese tank coal, we're going to kill all these people here. Beautiful. Awesome. Amazing. 40 combat width. Ah, Chinese technology is not far behind uh, those of Western powers. Oh my god. Two. Two. Yeah, we're going to be able to smash the Japanese now. And their allies. 1943. Middle Africa. Who are you? Last time we had a guy with a hat. Julian or Julian Schoener. Oh, good amount of manpower, very nice. Good amount of divisions, too. African Landtag. Spirit of von Vettelov Vorbeck. And it seems pretty stationary for now. I think the Federals, like I said last time, are going to lose. But, you know what, I could be completely wrong. Yeah. I could be completely wrong. Now, it's unfortunate for the Pacific States that they don't have a lot of cores on this territory, I think just claims, but the federal government, I think, does? Doesn't do they? Yeah, they have a lot of cores. Yeah, Oklahoma. Oh, no, they have cores, too. What happened to you guys? I thought you'd be stronger than that. No. Oh, trying to... See? Trying to navally invade me again with nine divisions. Probably isn't going to go very well for you. Tanks, are you here? Oh, my God. Just... Yes, please. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Lead the way, tanks. They can't even pierce us. Beautiful. Die, you're gonna become one hell of a general, man. Now we gotta keep an eye on our fuel, but this, this is great. This is just great. Good. Did we win here? <clears throat> yes, we did. 
I didn't even check, but we did win. Guns, artillery. Yeah, we need more artillery. What do we not need right now? Motorized. We can go come all the way down here. Because we have 3,000 things of motorized isn't bad, but I can wait. Um, I really don't want to train a navy. The only way we can get like a navy is to train those ships. It's not going to happen. I want this tile. I don't know if we can take it, though. There's not enough divisions around there. We're still getting attacked by Japan down here. Hmm. What are you guys up to? Go do that. Move up a little bit. Ah, dare to die core. Good. Ah, good. That's done as well. Awesome. Deck down that way. Let's go ahead and next do... Uh, that's not bad. More max planning, planning speed, maximum command power increase, and leader experience gain. I like that. Armored vehicles have been sparse in Chinese warfare, but regardless of our opinion, that will not be for long. As a matter of national security, the nationalists should be the first faction in China to study, perfect, and introduce motorized vehicles and tank warfare into the Chinese theater in mass numbers. And we've already done that. We've got these big old Chinese tanks that relatively few would be able to stop. Uh, I really need to do this. This output stuff is really important too, though. Cap and growth can kind of wait, though. Oh my goodness, yes. We can immediately make some of these. I'm going to go ahead and make some refineries. We get rubber and more fuel gain from these guys. Now, some people don't like using them. I love these things so much. Tibet, you're really pretty well developed. That's not bad. Go ahead and grab a little bit more steel from now from... God dang it, I hate this. Supporting my ally, or an enemy, really, indirectly. Uh, do that. Thank you. Cool. And we got enough to choose another decision. Uh, we're on limited exports. I don't want to lower. I still like the little bonus we get to construction speed and stuff like that. Um, doesn't help us research anything. This would help us research some stuff. Destroyers. Cruisers would be good to do. They, that would actually be really, really good to do, and I will do that. You know what? Let's do that right now. I could, help, I could do some help with research speed. Good, we'll have some Valkyrie heavy sh ships soon. Awesome, can they pierce my tanks? No. We don't have air superiority, which is kind of making this drawn out a little bit longer, but whatever. No upgrades yet. Good. Awesome. And it sounds like someone wants to navally invade me. Well, let them try. They will die, like normal. Six divisions, encircled, and killed. Anything going on over here? Nope. Yeah, you guys are still struggling against Nepal. That's honestly kind of pathetic, but you got a lot of manpower. They have only 72,000. 72,000. Good. Dead. They are dead. Can you kill that guy off? Or at least make him weaker. Ah, oh, yes. Shotgun. Ah, oh, more soft attack. Good. And we're done with that. Great. Let's immediately start researching some cruiser stuff. Actually, we're already okay on improved cruiser holes. I kind of like that. Get advanced cruiser holes. Good. Oh man, we're going to have a lot of divisions here to take out. That's okay. That's definitely okay. I need to take this supply base. That's going to be the most important thing. So, you guys, don't move around. Stay right there. Plan. Get organization. Plan it, plan it, plan, plan. Uh, oh, they're attacking me like crazy down here. Okay, well, I mean, sure. Yi, do you have any more upgrades for us? No. Which level 6? Holy crud. That's pretty high. Jin, do you have anything for us? No. You're almost level 5, though. That's cool. Oh, Zhang? No, I don't think so. That's okay. No upgrades yet. No upgrades yet. That's okay. Wasn't really expecting any, so. More naval invasions? Sure. I need this tile the most. So take all but, like, three. Leave with all you guys right here. Ah, Valkyrie. Good. Enter war. Good. Take the supply and let them starve. We're good on guns, finally. We need more artillery, though. Lower you by five. That hurts our production. Oh, we need more tungsten. Which actually, I'll, I'll get a little more tungsten. Yeah, why not? I can trade with, not the Russian Empire, the Bharatiya Commune. Yeah, good, good guys. Construction five? Yes, good. It's 1943. We can get more of that. It's only 60. Get some more rubber. This helps our industry out. And that would help our industry out so I can make more factories, so I can make things... Make more things elsewhere. Hmm. 
some good Chinese coffee. I will say, though, I would be terrified if I was these guys. Cut off. No supply. Oh, they're, they're panicking a little bit. They are definitely panicking. Let them panic. Let the fear set in. Oh, my God. We're already out of... We're out of infantry equipment because we keep making too many divisions. I don't need this many divisions anymore. So, as far as I know, make it lower to like six. There you go. Because you guys have a, a few too many right now. Two, three. One, two. There you go. So you guys come to Dali. In time, I do want you to build this area up. That'd be good. And you'll be led by a guy and deploy you not there, but like Kuming or something. Awesome. And actually, you guys, you have that. Uh, we have no more artillery. But actually, that'll give you quite a bit more strength, especially if you have to reclaim some provinces. I'm kind of okay with that. Oh, they're still attacking me. Any other naval invasions? No? Good. Strength of Japan. I haven't done this in a while. Less than a million manpower? Good. They don't have a ton of divisions. Yeah, they have a decent amount, but not bad. Alright. And they're starving? Good. Kill them off. You should be able to... Yep, easily win. Hold on. Before we move on, there are four divisions up here, even though some have already retreated. There are four divisions here, even though a lot are retreating, and then there are two there. So, I'm going to assume there's like 20 divisions in here. Good, good, good. And they're still attacking me. Good. They should be. Now, I doubt I'll be able to win here. I can really use some Mountaineers. You might be able to win, you might not. But that'd be great if you could take that tile. You guys. And then I will reform the front line. Once this tile is taken, I'll reform the front line. Amazing job, guys. <clears throat> Good. And then you guys will plan the attack to take out what? Um, there's really no good place for us, for us to attack. So you might as well just stay like down here. Because I want to get down here and take Port Arthur. Ah, uh, Port Arthur. Yeah, artillery. Yeah, definitely make more artillery. We're doing well on artillery now. That's good. That's very good. Refineries are being made. More civilian factories. I mean... China, at this point, is becoming quite the industrial powerhouse. I love it. In time, I do want to build up roads. Roads are fairly important. Not super important, but, you know, fairly important. And I will have to directly annex provinces as this campaign goes on, just because I'm running out of areas to build up stuff. So, so I can always get more factories and stuff like that. So, in time, keep build, 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 build. Good, 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 good. And I will take out the German East Indies eventually. I wonder what's going to happen. If the Ger the Reichspax falls, what happens to the German East Asia group? Like, after they fall, like, hmm. I guess they have to be directly taken out so that I can get their factories. Or their lands. Because, really, it's my land, but whatever. Yeah, build all this up. Build, 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 build. Especially up here in Mongolia, Russia, Tuva area. Tanu Tuva. What's Tanu Tuva? Uh, looks pretty good. Chinese industry is the best industry. Did we win here? Not yet. That's okay. Take your time. Take your time. Awesome. Tanks, you're looking pretty good. Looking kind of cute, tanks. Oh. Good. Lead with the tanks. And they won't be able to penetrate you. Good. Guns, doing very well. Artillery could be better. That's okay. Awesome, tanks. Immediately go that way if you can. Send half this way. Our, our organization isn't great, but it doesn't have to be. Let's circle these guys. And then I'll do a general push soon-ish. Good. Kill them off. There's five divisions there. Great. Naval invasions up there. Nope. Good. Oh, nope. We can't win here. That's okay. Well, hold on. Hold on. Never say never. Never say never. If you could throw in more divisions there, you might... Well, recovering divisions. You might be able to do that. As long as we keep an eye on this, we might be able to win. We might not. Mm. Nah, just, get, just hold on for now. It's okay. Can't win every time. Good, they're dead. You guys. 
Would you all be able to win? Let's use the tanks to break across the river first before we do anything else. So, you guys do that. You guys all just come over there. Half of you guys come here too. Break over the river and then I'll do a general push. Good, good, good. Wow, they're doing quite a bit of damage to us. And yet they're still losing. What a bunch of losers. Good. Awesome. Now, rest of everyone else, go ham. Tanks, you do what tanks do. Tank stuff. Good. Now, we don't have the artillery for this, but we have enough guns for this. And, oh, we need more support equipment. That's not good. Pull you this way. Pull the tanks. You have to help attack as well. Hmm. Attacking over the river is never a good idea, but we're winning across the main of the most of the front line. Good! Chang Y Kuo Commission with the formation of the Mechanized Warfare Study Commission. A recent graduate from the prestigious Kriegsschule in Munich has been recalled home. None other than Chang Wei Kuo, the late Chang Chang Kai Shek's second son. From seven Germany, he not only trained with Germany's elite Gebergsjäger, but learned about the latest ideas and experiments of mechanized warfare as he became a tank commander. He will certainly prove instrumental in the development of our armed forces. Ah, new general. Love it. Oh my goodness. Even more? Nice. I like it if my guys can learn more. So the art of synchronizing artillery, infantry, and armor into a successful offense is still new, but we cannot let other powers develop the perfect implementation ahead of us. The National Revolution's wars will allow us to learn what technical specifications are needed to create ideal arms and artillery for modern... Oh, more military factories. For modern war. Yeah, good. At this point, I think we have enough factories, really. I just need more resources, but we could start making some dockyards. Then, then again, I don't want to make garbage. Refineries. We're going to become an oil-producing nation. Like a major oil-producing nation. And f and rubber. Don't forget that rubber. I love the rubber. Good. You guys are hanging out. Actually, since that attack failed, let's go ahead and redeploy everyone on the front line here. Make ourselves stronger so that we can do better. Good. Yeah, we can't take... Can't quite take the capital, but... Everywhere else, we're doing pretty darn well. Under our drug abusing field marshal. Love it. Losses. It'll be, yeah, probably a million by the time this campaign is done against the Japanese in this war. How strong are these guys? Less than a quarter million manpower. That's good. They don't have that many divisions. Japan is, well, they're getting more manpower, which is unfortunate. Go ahead and lower it down to here. You guys hang... Hold on. You both come here. And we might be able to encircle the city. Give it just a little bit more time. Supply is not going to be really great. That's okay. You guys attack here. You might be able to encircle the city. Good. Overall, not bad. Not bad. We made another encirclement. And we killed off more divisions. Great. Guns are still okay. Artillery is getting worse. That's getting worse as well. Everyone attack here. Send one tank division to help out. They won't be able to stand up to tanks. Good. Shenyang. Looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. Yeah. Don't, 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 don't. Oh, you might still win though. You, you still have the capabilities of winning. Help them out. Yeah, maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, well. That might be the last thing we need to take out the reformed government of China, but probably not. Come on, take them out, take them out. Send you guys this way as well, attack them in the rear. And, boom, Shenyang is ours. They're almost capitulated. There they go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now this is a giant flipping mess. Go extreme. Some of these divisions don't have uh, strength. They have no supply. Now they do. God dang it. Push in, push in, push in. Good. Good. They lost 2 million. We've lost 800,000. The Japanese haven't lost enough. They've only lost 3.1 million. Ecuador joined the Andean Pact, which will do nothing in this campaign, probably. But whatever. But whatever. If you don't have Port Arthur, guys, take their ports. Oh, even though I put more divisions on the front, they're still attacking me. 
Cool. Oh my gosh. Dominion of India. The Entente just sucks in this campaign. Holy cow. Man, we need quite a bit of artillery. Um, artillery. There you go. Resource-wise, we got enough of that. Steel is always an issue. Um... Not enough factories. We're approaching 300 factories. That's still not enough. Oh, the, the tanks... Oh, they made it down here. Nice. Good. Cut these guys off. Nice. Good job, guys. You're doing great. Look at these divisions. Encircled. The Japanese soldiers don't know what they're doing. Love it. Come on. Make it way down here. Faster. Faster. I know the game's lagging pretty hard. It's all 1943. Whatever. Awesome. Immediately give them hell, boys. Take the Port Arthur. The Port Arthur? Oh, just Port Arthur. Good. Ooh. 0.96 a day. Continue to industrialize. Ah, there goes the Dominion of India. Good. Beautiful. Don't give him an out. No outs for you. Amazing. Oh, dockyards. Yes. Pre Vault Creek. Uh, how close are we to making? Um, make more convoys for now. And then I'll start making some cruisers, no matter, no matter how garbage they might be. Oh, Ghost Guards, I need you too. almost forgot about this. This is kind of dangerous, not putting Ghost Guards on here. A little dangerous, a little dangerous. And we'll need that as well. Go and do this area too. Awesome, I told you guys I would kill off the reformed government of China in this episode, and I have. I love it. Awesome. Now go ahead and reform this. There you go. That makes more sense. Ooh. Low. No, nothing. No upgrade, really. Uh, I want you to help take out Transamir, my tanks. Keep it up, guys. Keep it up. More divisions. Awesome. That looks pretty weak. I want to attack this area. Tactical bombers. We should have enough planes down here to start moving maybe potentially a little bit. Give me some more tactical bombers. You need more air support if you're going to attack into Burma. Good. Yes, advanced cruiser holes. Awesome. Um, do that as well. I could use more air bases around here. We don't have air superiority. I might be able to, oh, oh. I might be able to win here. Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's see. Keep focusing a little bit more on these guys. We're definitely going to need even better armor than... Oh, that took up all of my naval XP. Holy crud. So, basically, we're left with... Hmm. Hmm. What happens if I take that off? I don't get it back. Okay, well, I just... Ooh. Hmm. Hmm. That's not good. Mm, I'll see if I can try to fix that somehow. Oh, there goes Romania. There goes Poland. Can't make any ships. I might have to use console commands to make ships now, just to give myself a little bit more XP. It wouldn't really matter too much, since we already have maxed out land XP and air XP, but... Hmm, I might have just made a... Oopsie. Oh, good. Good. We're doing well. We're still doing well. Keep it up, guys. Go crazy. They still are putting more divisions up here, but that's okay. They can't hold us back forever. Japan, you've lost a couple guys. Transamur. Yeah, you definitely won't be able to hold up against us. Good. More fuel, 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 fuel. Awesome. Oh, oh, yes. Rubber processing. Give me, give me even more rubber. I want to be rubber independent of other nations. Good. Never fight a land war in Asia. You cannot win. Never, ever. Hmm. 
You know what? Hmm. I'm thinking. What would be a fair trade-off? Oh, hold on. Before we do that, before I tell you what I'm thinking about, modern combat. Great. Can I get some naval XP from here? We can. So let's, I need to go down this path. So, separate naval command. Up until now, much of the Republic of China has been effectively subordinated to the needs of the NRA. However, any nation that wants security on its own terms need to have, needs to have a strong navy. As victories mount on land, Admiral Chen Xiaoquan has pushed for more independence for the navy and for serious consideration of building up a navy capable of independent operations at sea. Good. I was thinking about maybe like using console commands to lower, like, get rid of like 50 political power for like 20 naval XP. I think that'd be fairly balanced, you know. Spend some political power, get a little bit more naval XP. I think that'd be kind of actually fairly balanced, but yeah, we'll see what happens. And the Reichspact is dying. Oh, the Reichspact. They're still holding out here. That's amazing. They're still holding out. That's awesome. Ah, oh, that's that would be one hell of a war story if you heard. Just like half a million Germans trapped and France completely surrounded, cut off for, on all sides. That would make one heck of a story. That'd be awesome if that was you know really true. Extraction? I could really, really use some extraction. Because we're not extracting a lot of aluminum, but that would help out with that. Maybe rubber. Definitely tungsten. Definitely steel. Oh my goodness. Even more advanced holes, please. Thank you very much. Now, it doesn't look like we're really winning too much now. We'll see what happens. I mean, he still says we're, we'll be doing okay. Losses approaching a million. Makes sense. Take out Vladivostok if we can. That'd be great good. Yeah, the tanks aren't winning here. Um, hmm. Yeah, they're doing okay-ish. My goal is, I guess at this point, the goal is to take out Transamir. Some more? Japan's got a lot more manpower now. Was that an encirclement? That was an encirclement. They're dead now. Good. Lower your attacks down a little bit. Being too aggressive isn't always worth it. Oh, we're out of guns again. And artillery. Let's go ahead. You guys focus on these guys down here. There's no one over here. You know what? Be careful for now. Good. Oh my goodness. Please tell me Hungary is not in the war against Russia. O Ottomans. Come on, man. Russia, I don't want to trade with you. No, I don't want to trade with Russia. Hmm. You know what? Can I build more factories quicker? So I can get more fuel? Oh, no, we'll see what happens. Come on, guys. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. I need to attack Transamir quickly. Like, quite a few things there. Okay. We took a good chunk of Korea. A little chunk. Not a big chunk, but a little chunk. Alright, you guys can stop attacking now. Good. Nearly a million casualties. Pretty much expected. Alright, who can't pay up? Prince of, Prince of Federation? Huh. That's a little unusual. Anyone else have... Ah, uh, Africa. I love it. Cool. You might be able to win here. But you might not be able to. Yep, go ahead and hold. Let our armies rest up a little bit more. You guys, oh, you guys. Actually, that's a good area to attack. You cut, all, cut off all these divisions. That could be really, really good. Oh, you guys are cut off up here. Nice. Let's let our tanks get a little bit more supply. That'd be actually a good thing to do. If you guys could take these guys out, that'd be great. Destroy those divisions. Hmm... How many divisions are right here? That could be like the main battle, but this is really... That's more of a distraction at this point. This is what we really want. Good. Yeah, a million losses. That's pretty much what I was expecting. Good. Keep them like that, because they get no supply around here. And have you guys been cut off yet? No, you haven't. Good. Death to these enemies. They have a division there, and they have two divisions there. Not much, but hey, better than nothing. Better than nothing. Ooh, yeah, Middle Africa. Alright, Ottomans, you're really disappointing me now. I really don't want to do this, but 
fuel. I, I need it for my own war efforts for now. Oh, actually. Lower that by two. Union of South Africa. Welcome aboard, Union. Fuel, 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 fuel. Oh my goodness. They love attacking me. And then build one more. Yeah, yeah, cool. Because we're going to need a ton of fuel when I make it this navy. Uh, just a ton of fuel. Oh good, we cut these guys off. Beautiful. I love it. If you can, kill them off, please. You might not be able to just yet. That's okay. It's going to take time. Seven divisions are trapped there. A single division is trapped there. And then they have three more. Love it. Tanks, hope you're resting. Getting more tanks in into your arms. Armies, your divisions. I can't speak today. My goodness, we need a lot of support equipment, though. Good. Integrate. Ah, Shandong, you're next. Ah, uh, yeah, you guys wanted to attack that direction. That's okay. Division-wise, Transamir. You're not bad. Burma's not bad either. What's going on in Burma? I haven't looked down there in a while. Just kind of hanging out. Just kind of hanging out. They'll probably attack me again eventually, but maybe not. Need more bombers for this area. Basic cruiser armor scheme. Nice. Get some more. Oh, you got supply issues. That's not bueno. Could you win here, maybe? You might be able to. Take a piece of actual Siamese land? Maybe not. Oh, we got air superiority. That's kind of nice. Maybe not. Cool. Build this area up more then. We need more airplanes. Yeah, go ahead and hold. Yeah. This is going to be a mess. I might not be able to take take those guys out yet. All I really need is Japan. Let's see what happens. Ooh. Hello there. I know this video is going to go on quite a while. I know my videos for this campaign has gone on for quite a while. Like, the length of these guys. Oh, there goes Berlin. A great victory for the Russian Empire, indeed. But just because I only made so many thumbnails. <laughs> right, how many divisions are stacked here? Ah, 18. That makes sense. Yeah. I don't think we'll be able to take this province just yet. Yeah, go ahead and hold. If that's the case, so be it. We will use the tanks to much greater effect. God dang it, guys. Who... Oh, South Africa. I want to help you out. I really do. But you can't do this. Oh my goodness. Nice. Thank you very much for supporting me, Bharatiya Commune. But now I can support myself other places. That's why extraction is so good. I love extraction. Illyria. Hello there. Hello, Illyria. Thank you for playing. Good. We're a little bit out of stalemate for now. That's okay. We definitely need more guns and artillery, which is pretty much this entire campaign. And the game is going to lag very hard soon once Germany loses all their victory points. How's the Civil War going? Yeah. God dang it. I would have loved to see the Pacific States finally do well in the campaign, but... It is for naught. Now, let me give me some more bombers up here or something. Ah, separate naval command. Good. Let's go ahead and do light ship focus. So, China's naval forces have always been reliant on foreign shipyards and designers for its fleets. The first generation of all Chinese fleet production should focus on the development of light and heavy cruisers for the most economical and versatile results, as opposed to plunging into the more doctrinally uncertain world of battleships and carriers. Absolutely. Now, give me some more fighter twos. That'd be great. And good. Put you on those guys. That'll be important. You guys are where you're supposed to be, which is good. Immediately come down this way. Crush them. And then you will come down that way to take out these guys. Yes, I know I have Coast Guards. Eh, maybe I should take the Coast Guards off. I'm trying to kill themselves off. Do that, do that. Do that for now as well. That'd be good. Everyone hold. Because militia divisions are just kind of a waste when they're attacking like that. Help attack down here. I need people to help guard the area. Fuel. It's looking okay. We get barely any political power. Holy cow. Ah, occupation. That's what's eating everything up. Yeah, I'm going to tell you to hold, son. You know what? If anything, you help attack. Get these guys out of here as fast as possible. Nope. We're probably not going to be able to win. Darn it. Get the infantry in here. Good, they're in here. Mm. You know what? Really? Just stay here. Don't move. 
Get a little bit more organization and stuff like that. If you can, maybe attack that way. Maybe not. Maybe supply down here is so bad we can't do anything. Yeah, it's so bad we can't do anything. So be up. We'll have to attack with infantry. That's fine. Uh, they spread it out this way? That's okay. Make themselves weaker. Can I attack anywhere here, perhaps? Perhaps. Perhaps not. Japan is still pretty strong. Because the Anton is very, very weak. They're a very pathetic Anton in this campaign. Then again, the Anton is never really that strong. They can do okay as long as Germany does okay, but other than that, you know. Oof. No, oh, that's disappointing. Hmm. Alright, German Empire, come on, man. Yeah, just give me that one that I could use. Good, win there. We still need more victories. Not bad, not bad. Hmm. Could you win there? Potentially. Potentially. You can kind of pierce us, though, so maybe not. Do you guys attack here as well? No, you can. You can. Good. Do that. If you can, kill them all off here and circle these divisions. That would be lovely. Very lovely. And I need more fuel. Again. More fuel. I've traded with the Ottomans before, but... Let's see how that goes. Again. Awesome. Beautiful. Kill them off immediately. Give them no peace. I mean, you can try to kill us, but it's not going to work. Even if you take that tile, it's still not going to work. Good. Four divisions there. You guys were defeated. Uh, you have six there. Awesome. Thank you for playing Japan. Thank you very much. 69. Nice. Not bad. Any attacks down here? Nope. The Prince of Federation is looking pretty good. Europe is on fire. I'm kind of waiting for G Germany to fall and then we'll end the campaign there, but we'll see what happens. I can't win there just yet. All right. Yeah. Kill them off, please. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Please kill them off. Kill them off. You guys are pretty injured. Let you guys move up that way. Yeah. Oh, the Filipinos are up here, too. And once this area is taken out, I will end the episode. I know it's gone on quite a long time for this campaign. Or this video, at least. Oh, look. A lot of divisions. A lot of dead divisions. Good. Fifteen more dead divisions. Go ahead and help out. Go ahead and help out. Oh, never mind. They're dead. Ah, even more rubber. Great. Fuel now. Give me even more fuel. But that's pretty much all the time that we have for in this campaign today. Well, guys, what have we done? We've taken out the reformed government of China. We've taken a good chunk of Transamur. We've also just pushed barely into Burma. And honestly, we've taken a lot of casualties, but it's been worth it. The Code Prosperity Sphere has lost roughly 10 million. And, of course, Europe is on fire. But anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching this very long video. If you liked it, maybe consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you all tomorrow as we will finish Japan in the next video. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.